Hi, a very good morning to all of you. So today with us, we have Shreya, who has got into IIT Madras for the academic session 2024-25. Hi, Shreya, a warm welcome to you. Thank you, sir. Okay. Shreya, let's begin with a very uh, basic question in terms of your background, uh, which course you pursued and from where exactly? Uh, so I've been doing my IMA in economics from University of Hyderabad. So it's actually an integrated course, but uh, there's also an exit option that's available after three years, which I'm taking right now. Great. The, 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 because the co course you mentioned, the integrated one, because one of the students recently started the two-year batch, and she's also actually looking forward to an exit right before the master's. Okay, great, great, Shreya. Okay, so uh, Shreya, uh, from day one, uh, which institution was in your mind like this is my dream college or this is my dream university institution, right? And I would like to pursue my master's in economics right from there. Uh, yes, sir. So I know everyone was aiming for probably Delhi School of Economics or IGIDR, but I actually wanted to go to IIT Madras. So I'm also a student of music, uh, Carnatic Vocal and Meena. So uh, Chennai is the hub for Carnatic music too. So I was sort of, you know, trying to align all my goals into a particular city. And huh. so I decided to, you know, try to get into IIT Madras for that. Great, great. So you, you actually did align it perfectly well with your with your goal or along with your hobbies as well so nice amazing okay so uh shreya like when when exactly you started your preparation like because students still they have this uh notion whether should they start in second year of the graduation third year or even as far as third year ka last semester may should we start so when exactly did you start your preparation like this is the day and i'm going to be damn serious about my preparation uh yeah i think my preparation was a little fragmented of sorts uh, because i was not really getting serious at the beginning i i heard of the entrance exams in september of last year so mm -hmm. that's when i started my preparation and it was uh, going well at first. I think for like the first 20, 30 days, I was very diligent with my preparation. Uh, but then, you know, I started getting a little lazy. Also, I have a confirmed like master's seat at University of Hyderabad itself. So I think that was a factor driving my laziness. And so I actually ended up taking a break for about two months from preparing. And I started again in December when I realized, you know, I need to get serious about it and I better prepare well or not don't prepare at all. And so in December, I kind of speed ran through the entire portion and uh, that's when I got serious properly. So a uh, couple of points over here, because like I always say, each and every individual had their own strategies and their own journey. So you very honestly mentioned how the preparation was. And another important point you highlighted that because you were in the integrated course. So in the back of the mind, you always had ki, hai, I'm still sorted, even if I'm not able to do it, right? And that uh, leisure, that liberty should never be there in the mind if you're targeting uh, an exit to a better institution. So, and still you were able to kind of convince yourself, start again and not only start again, but to also crack the exam and get into an institution like IIT. Amazing. Okay. Shreya, so uh, how how was the preparation like so we will we, we, did you start right from basic or you were going along with the live lectures and the intermediate level so what was your approach uh which actually kind of aligning with your bachelor's curriculum as well so how was it yeah honestly because of my economics background and you know simultaneously doing everything at college i didn't have to look at a lot of concepts like for example public economics and econometrics there were two subjects i completely skipped because i was already doing them at college and i didn't think it was necessary to do it again i think my main focus is micro because the micro in the entrances is very very complicated as compared to what we learn in college so micro i think was the one subject i was focusing the most on uh the other subjects i was not i'm not really a person who gathers too much like i i study better when i read so wow. i was mainly uh reading from textbooks and i was doing a lot of the quizzes that were that was there on the portal and uh, there were some concepts however that i was regularly watching the videos for for example uh risk and um uh yeah uh 
Really endowment. And yeah, there were some concepts that I was constantly looking at the lectures for, but mainly it was books and quizzes. Correct, correct. Okay. So because uh, when we have started for the micro, everyone feels ki kap khatam hoga, micro kap khatam hoga, right? When we are about to wrap, but like you also highlighted and we also push for it is because all the entrances, micro is of course common, that is for sure. But that also comes for the majority of marks as well. So yeah. you, you need to give as much time as possible to do that. Okay. So did you did you uh, attempt any mocks before the exams? Uh, I did the past year uh, papers of GATE, like the, uh, for, the I think the three years of right. Yeah, and I, I mainly I looked at what kind of questions were coming because every entrance exam has a sort of pattern in the way they ask questions. And especially I noticed that 2022 and 2023, they were very similar in the papers that they gave for GATE. Mm -hmm. So I mainly analyzed, you know, how they were giving the papers. Like for econometrics, I, I kind of was able to predict what questions were going to come. Mm -hmm. Uh, so, yeah, that's mainly what I did. I only did three papers, but I was also looking at them a lot of times so that I could see where I need to study from and what kind of questions were coming. Great, great. So, uh, in terms of strategy, you would like to share with the students because now the dates for GATE is also out and the dates for JAM is also out, kind of. It's just the website is about to go live. So what is your suggestion in terms of strategy or approach, whatever it can be anything? Yeah, uh, yeah I just think you have to um, solve as many questions as possible, because at first we don't want to really solve any tests because, you know, we're kind of scared of sc scoring a little mm -hmm. low. I think it's very important to do question banks, but I also think it's very important to do uh, time constrained tests because when you're just doing a question bank without a time limit, you know, you have all the time in the world to just solve a question. And sometimes I would spend even half an hour on a question, which is obviously not feasible in a in an entrance exam. So if even if it's like topic wise tests, it there's a time constraint. I found myself thinking differently when I was, you know, solving under a time constraint as opposed to when I was not. So uh, it's really important to do time-based tests because that's what prepares you for an entrance. That's how you know how to solve a question to get an answer in a limited amount of time. So I think mainly quizzes, time-based quizzes. Great, great. Okay. So like uh, now, like the final question in the sense uh, we did discuss. So what what is your future uh, target, future goals that you're looking forward post your master's at IIM, IIT Madras? Uh, yes, sir. So I mainly, I think I want to go into research. I am keeping all my avenues open, but I do think I want to pursue a PhD in the subject. Okay. Any plans to move out of, uh, move out and do it from abroad or? Uh... Uh, no, sir. I, I like India. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Great. Great. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much, Rhea, for your time and transparently, honestly answering and sharing your experience for all the students. And I hope they will gain a lot of experience and information from your journey. And all of them will look forward to different IITs and pursuing their masters from that. Thank you so much, Shreya. Thank you, sir.